everybody I ain't shot a video from the truck work truck in a while so this video is just out there for the average people who are battling with um, being overweight and stuff like that so uh, you know I can relate I used to be you know pretty big um, you know I was you know I still you know I'm type 1 diabetic I uh, have high blood pressure uh, I had sleep at me pretty bad I was um, at my heaviest I think close to 230 somewhere around there but um you know I was to the point back in those days you know I'm only 5'8 so I was back in those days when I was heavy I was to the point where I could I could almost qualify you know I can qualify to get gastric so I thought about it you know but I didn't do it I just started you know putting in work you know try to watch what I'm eating, you know, fasting here and there, um, and I've been working out straight, uh, five, at least minimum five days a week for, um, August 8th will be, uh, four years straight, so, taking my supplements, stuff like that, so I've been putting in the work, so, um, just letting y'all know it doesn't happen overnight, this is, uh, you know, rep, sweat, and years, man, it, it just, it's just, it's a long road, especially when you're natural, so, it's a long road so just be patient and uh, you know the first thing you're gonna notice if you start to get your nutrition down pat I'm not the best with my nutrition so I'm not I'm not gonna lie about that uh, I'm a foodie I love food so you know I just you know either try to stay high protein low carbs will help help you out because carbs ain't my friend you know so um, it's just a long road so y'all just need to be patient you know the first thing y'all notice if, if y'all get y'all's nutrition now patty get y'all a lifting program um first thing you're gonna notice is your clothes are gonna fit loose that's the first thing you're gonna notice you know so uh and then people you you know people you don't know you ain't seen or people you haven't relatively ain't seen a lot of times so you're like oh man you're getting skinny you ain't gonna see it because you, you see yourself every day i don't step on scales because to me they discourage me and i think they'll discourage you because you know your weight will fluctuate five pounds so I don't like the scale, but I, I get weighed when I go to the doctor, so, you know, so that's, that's how I know how much I lost, or they tell me, oh, you lost this much pounds, so, um, that's how I do it, I don't like stepping on the scale, because I don't want that to stop me from trying to achieve my goals and push me to keep going, because I, I don't want to rely on the weight, I'd rather go by how my clothes feel, how you feel, you know, your confidence a boost, so, just stay positive, man. So, just letting y'all know that uh, people who deal with the, of being overweight, you know, it's it, it's hard. It's a long road. And it's hard. So, just keep it up. Uh, the majority of the fitness industry, you know, are um, most of them were the skinny kids in school. You know, so it's it's the only problem the skinny people have is putting on muscle. You know, you gotta. A big person, fat person, their problem is trying to put on muscle and burn fat. So it's it's not it's not easy. So, but most of them, you know, look very impressive. You know, compared to me, because they're, they're just skinny. They don't have no fat on them, and then they're just putting on muscle. So, and plus, I'm natural. So I'm not saying everybody's not natural, but you know, when you're a natty fatty and trying to get fit it, it's hard it's a long road so just letting you know keep your heads up man and um keep pushing and uh we can do it you know so take a long time take a lot of years to get to where you need to be so just stick with it because what's 45 minutes an hour of your day you know really ain't, ain't much you sit on the couch watching tv doing this not nah, nah, eating all you need is 45 minutes an hour a day five days a week to work out minimal break you know 10 second breaks 15 second breaks to uh, do your cardio and your weight training at the same time that's how I do it I do short breaks and I lift and I just if you ain't got time to do cardio do it like that just lift with short breaks and you're doing your cardio at the same time you're lifting so you kill two birds with one stone so um you know, that's how I do it. That's how I try to keep the weight down. Um, because, it's it's like I said, it's a long road. It doesn't happen overnight. And you just got to keep keep going. Keep going for your family. Keep going 
for your, you know, to stay here in this life longer for your, your loved ones, you know, that's why I push because I have a wife and kid. And I don't want to leave them early from my diabetes and my high blood pressure, you know. It's just, you got to stay fit. You got to stay active. You just got to keep on pushing. And uh, thanks for watching.